Advanced Student Council here at Eastern Virginia Medical School in Norfolk, Virginia. We're here to complete the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. We were nominated by the VCU School of Medicine Student Government. We're here with Dr. Paula Ravage. He's our brain guy. I'm happy to be here. I'm proud that our students have accepted this challenge from VCU. I'd like to say that we're trying to increase awareness for ALS, a hypothalamic sclerosis, and funding for research. I'd like to acknowledge the uh, local chapter, the Tidewater chapter, the American uh, uh, of the ALS uh, Society Association. I'd like to acknowledge the ALS clinic that we run here in partnership with our neurology colleagues in Sinclair. And I'd like to acknowledge our basic science researcher, Dr. Godfrey, on ALS. But we're not here because this is bad. We're not here because it's so cool and Pack of Woods did this. We're not here to cool off on a hot summer day. We're here to commit ourselves to brain disorders, neurological disorders, psychiatric disorders, which account for the greatest burden of disease and the greatest cost of disease here in the United States and around the world. We need to advocate for better policy programs, disability rights issues, better community care services. We need to understand that ALS research helps Huntington's disease research, which helps Parkinson's disease research. We need to speak as a voice and to deal with the largest minority population on Earth, according to the United Nations. Persons with disabilities and neurological and psychiatric causes are the principal reasons we have such persons with those problems. So let's go EVMS. If we can put a dozen people on the moon, then we can cure ALS, we can cure Huntington's, we can cure Parkinson's, we can cure schizophrenia, TBI, stroke, and all that stuff. So thank you, VCU, uh, for our students accept the challenge. The only thing different is our students are probably the most community oriented in the nation and you will not believe how they will accept your challenge. As future healthcare providers, we hope to raise awareness and build support for the ALS Association. We hope that this movement remains strong and not only improves research but also individualized care for both patients and families affected by ALS. 23,000 Americans live with this debilitating condition every day. Today, we are here to support each and every one of them. ALS is one of many neurodegenerative diseases. EVMS students are committed to rise to a challenge to provide the best care to all patients. The EVMS student body would like to nominate medical schools in our neighboring states, including Georgetown University, George Washington University, Johns Hopkins University, Howard University, and the University of Maryland School of Medicine.